if the base set is empty if the base set is empty let's see this let's do analysis of this on this set remember your base set is empty so on empty set basically on empty set you are defining any relation you define relation r then what this relation r will be automatically tell me this relation r what that will be relation r will be automatically empty because your base set is empty your base set is empty so automatically your relation r will be empty agree correct now your base set is empty and relation r is empty both are empty then in this situation what can you say this relation r is it reflexive in this situation tell me your base set is empty means basically empty relation on empty set okay empty relation on empty set this is the question empty relation on empty set empty relation on empty set is this reflexive is this reflexive empty relation on empty set is this reflexive yes this is reflexive why this is reflexive because remember if you remember what is the uh, c okay just just this point you remember very simple very simple point in the mathematical logic we have seen if domain is empty if your domain is empty if your domain is empty do you remember i told you if domain is empty then for all statements then this type of statements like for all okay for all start this type of statement for all this type of statements for all x this type of statement here you can have anything this type of statement what this will be if domain is empty if domain is empty then this will be true i told you this type of statements are true if domain is empty then this type of statement okay this type of universal statement basically if domain is empty then universal statements these universal statements these are true i can say if domain is empty then universal statements are true and these existential statements what about them these existential statements they will be false if domain is empty then they will be false we have already seen this in the mathematical logic if domain is empty now here you can notice your base set is empty your base set is empty so what it means what is the definition of reflexive just look at the definition of reflexive so okay tell me what is the definition of reflexive that is like this for all x x is related to x this is the definition right yes or no for all x x is related to x correct so this is a universally quantified statement right this definition of reflexive this is a universal quantified statement so if domain is empty then what this will become so if base set is empty then this will become true if your base set is empty empty relation on empty set if your domain domain means base set if your base set is empty okay then it is reflexive this will become true because the definition of reflexive it will become true so when domain empty i can say when base set empty then what can you say when base set empty then this will become true then this will become true when base set is empty do you agree what is the definition of symmetric what is the defin definition of symmetric write the definition of symmetric what is that that is like this for all x comma y okay something inside for all x comma y this type of thing is inside right okay again this is a universally quantified statement again this is universally quantified statement so when your base set is empty then this will become true agree this is also universally quantified statement when domain is empty then universally quantified statement will become true so you can notice this is also this definition of symmetric this is also universally quantified statement so this will be true what is the definition of anti symmetric tell me the definition of anti symmetric that is like this for all x comma y okay if both are related if x is related to y and y is related to x then x is equal to y correct yes or no this is the definition do you remember this is the definition of anti symmetric for all x comma y 
if x is related to y, y is related to x, then x is equal to y. Again, is this universally quantified, this anti-symmetric definition, is this universally quantified? Is this universally quantified? Yes, this is also universally quantified. So when base set is empty, this is also true. When the base set is empty, this is also true. What about the definition of irreflexive? What about the definition of irreflexive? What definition we have for irreflexive? That is like this. For all elements, X is not related to X. For all elements, X is not related to X. Is this, is this universally quantified statement? Is this universally quantified statement? Yes. So when base set is empty, then this is also true. Now tell me the transitivity. So let's see the definition of transitive. What is transitive definition? This is saying that for all x comma y comma z, for all x comma y comma z, if x is related to y and y is related to z, then x is related to z. Is this quantified universally quantified statement? This is also universally quantified statement. So when base set is empty, this also will become true. What is the definition of asymmetric? What is the definition of asymmetric? This is saying that for all x comma y, if x is related to y, then y is not related to x. Okay, this is the definition of asymmetric. If x is related to y, then y is not related to x. Okay, this is a universally quantified statement. So when base set is empty, this is also. True. So can you notice? Can you notice empty relation on empty set? that has all the properties it is reflexive also it is symmetric also it is anti-symmetric also it is transitive also it is asymmetric also it is irreflexive also because all these definitions are universally quantified statements to how many people this concept is clear all these definitions reflexive symmetric anti-symmetric transitive asymmetric irreflexive all these definitions are universally quantified statement so if your base set is empty if your base set has nothing there is no element in the base set means what it means the universally quantified statement will become true so relation uh, okay i can say if your base set is empty then every relation is empty yes or no on empty on empty base set every relation is empty correct so this is the idea that empty relation or I can say every relation on empty set. I can also say every relation on empty set, right? Yes or no? Yes or no? Every relation on empty set. Because on empty set, every relation is phi. On empty set, every relation is phi, right? On empty set, every relation is phi. Every relation is empty. Okay, so this is the idea. Just tell me this point also, this question. Okay, empty relation on non-empty set, which properties are satisfied? Empty relation on non-empty set. Empty relation on non-empty set. Which properties are satisfied? Is it reflexive? Is it symmetric? Is it anti-symmetric? This we have already seen actually. So I will just give you the answer. I will not give you the explanation because we have already seen this in the relation chapter. In the relation chapter, we have already seen. So tell me, is this reflexive? Empty relation on non-empty set. So this is not reflexive. This is definitely symmetric. This is anti-symmetric also. This is asymmetric also. This is transitive also. And this is irreflexive also. Okay, so this reflexive property is not true. Remaining properties are correct for empty relation on non-empty set.